Hi, welcome back. I am from Exploring Excel. Myself, Amida Borkar. You can email me at exploringofficeexcel at gmail dot com. This is video number twenty. Select case in Excel VBA. Let's move on to our sheet. Okay. Now this time I have to select uh, use the select case property to look up the ticket price uh, through age. For example, when I click here, enter your age. So for example, age twenty four. Okay. So your ticket price is dollars twenty four. Okay, so okay, if I write sixty, okay, so the ticket price is dollar ten. Okay, if I write forty five, the ticket price is dollar twenty six. So according to that, it lookups the price uh, through select case rather than using multiple nested if like if age. Uh, I will show you in a VBA only. Let's move on to VBA Visual Basics. So here in the VBA, uh, so uh, one second, uh, so that it will be visible for you all. Okay. So in the Visual Basics, I have just written a small sort of code here. I will explain you in a moment. Just uh, Control C. Okay, so this sort of code I have written here. I will explain you. But rather than using if statement uh, again and again, so if so if my age is less the uh, according to zero to seven, my age is less than equals to seventeen, then uh price equals to twenty two. Else, else if, else, then again if I'm using if, if age is less than and so on, so it creates a big list of nested list fun, uh, nested list. So rather than doing such a big nested list, you can just Do select case. Firstly, I have just uh, when I but wait a second. I will reduce this. Okay. First thing I have done here is uh, I have just uh, age equals to input box. Enter your age and age information. The input box function is very easy. Age equals to input box. You can see the uh, syntax prompt. Prompt means uh whatever what you want enter your age and this is title i will just show you one this is prompt and this is the title okay so then uh select case now uh, select case then after you type in select case you need to write uh from which type means age and what so ever Miss, I have selected age. So, what is the value of age now, which I have entered in the input box? Suppose it's twenty-four. So it will look up. K zero to seventeen. No, it's eighteen to forty. Yes. So the price is twenty. Then it will come to the message box. The price of your ticket is so and so, and the format is dollars. Oops. Or the format is dollars and this. Or uh, here. See, if I select. Um, Uh, if I after doing this, uh, if I select the case, or twenty four suppose, then it will go twenty four no forty four. It will directly jump on to here. Then it will directly show the message box, and in this will be the format in this dollar dot zero zero. You can just see ticket price. Suppose I write forty four. This is prompt, and this is title. Then when I click OK. The ticket price is twenty six. Or is a type of a uh, VLOOKUP inside a database inside your code. Uh, I will show you debugging method. One second. Show you in debug. Effect. F five. Oops. Okay. Oh, so when I just 
okay it did show the ticket price of ticket is blank so i don't want to see it so i can just make some editing here select before select this yes. if age if age equals to null set oops then exit sum else 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 and if and if for this finish my code so when i just click it cancel it will not show that message box here for this sort of code i have written to it selects the case which you want like from 0 to 7 and the, then it determines the price equals to then price then price and here i have used the format dot price that's it this is a uh, this is a sort type of ticket details regarding ticket price in the next section i will show you how to do the adult ticket booking for that i have just used a small sort of code here just if the age is greater than less than 18 then the message box you are not eligible else they select me there's nothing different here only the different code here is this much so it's very easy you can also try this at your own so, control c control v so you can just try this sort of code here add the ticket booking there's nothing bit complicated inside this but it's okay like select case so the next time i am going to show you the search ticket numbers but the search ticket numbers will be shown you and this this is nothing oops okay next time i'll show you the search ticket numbers so thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe and watch more videos on exploring excel have a great day